Sick Us. It is your boy, Dick Nesson, right here. Hope you guys enjoyed the new series. Yeah, I have gotten some really amazing feedback from you guys. This is really amazing. Like, it's really encouraging for you guys, you know. Me, me and Max are doing our best to make the series as good as possible with the editing thing that I have. But this is a different video. From Struggle Super, prediction video. You got, uh, I don't know if it's really confirmed or not, but episode 66 is Farewell Trunks. So, I guess the Zomit Sue Future Trunks Black Arc will end episode 66. Well, officially, that fight will end season 6. But this is my prediction video. I predict that, you know, of course, Trunks has two sister beings. He will feed it to both Goku and Vegeta, and then jump back in their minds, hey Supreme Guy, I mean, hey Supreme Kai, let's fuse. And they fuse, become Vegito, greatness, turn God mode, greatness, and fight Zamasu. Now, this is, you know, this is a little fan theory that I have about on Zamasu, but it's really kind of confirmed, and I hope that Akira Ak Toriyama and Toei remember this scene way back in Z, the debut arc, where Elder Kai told Goku to, like, don't transform and fuse. Because that will fuck up the fusion. But, you know, it'll make it really unstable. So, you know, fuse in your base form and transform if you want to or need to. In the fusion form. Now, Zamatsu, you no, know, no, if you remember, Black was in his Super Saiyan Rose form. Not in his base form. And they fused together to create the Supreme God Zamatsu, King God Zamatsu, Merge Zamatsu, what do you want to call him? And that could be a way to, you know, that could be also a possibility about him, you know, he's in this fucking purple path based form because of, you know, Black's mistake. Black didn't know. Now, that could be a possibility, or maybe because, I heard this theory a lot, but maybe because the time ring was destroyed, which is bull, well, I won't say bullshit, it might happen in the episode, I don't know, but, when you see, well, if you watch the preview of the fight, you see, when he, when he's to turn around, and this is right here, at, you know, well, at, well, at Pochito, if you slow down the picture a little bit, you can see his time ring. So, Samatsu does have the time ring, even though there are one person. And, and it's leading to Boma getting ready, got all, we'll get, either go through the past, get some Master Roshi, the stamp thing, and come back into the future, or they create a whole new one. And, of course, it has to be Trunks. Trunks has to be the one to beat Zamatsu. He has to. Like, he has to. It's his future, his world. He's doing it for them. And, and it's for his future also. So, I predict that, you know, that Crunk might aid to help with a Cheeto and fight, like, and fight Samusu together. After that, being a little bit, you, you know, beat him up a little bit. And then, Crunk's for you see, you know, with my Fuba to capture Samusu, put him into my Fuba, and send him away for good. And, I don't know, like, if I don't worry, I think they should go back in time to the past, use, use the Dragon Balls to, use the Super Dragon Balls to wish back Trunks' future world. That's something that they can do, but it, it toys it takes it in, like, a whole other, you know, direction. It could also use, it could also use Bichito and go to dynamic planet and trucks his timeline. That's also a possibility. Or, which I do not expect Toei to, to, to do this, but, but, but they do. Toei, you have my full respect. Like, Toei, I will fucking love you forever. Like, if you do this, like, if you guys really, you know, go with this, you can beat Zamasu on uh, stuff and let Trunks deal with this broken world. Let them, you know, work, you know, let them, re you know, let them repopulate. But this isn't a bad idea, but it's fucking dark as shit. But he does have the hope to move on. 
Yeah. And also, we have an article from, I think, the director from Koei. I see Sue Kido, producer interview. Which is wrong with uh, all these? Back to producer. Well, that's just embarrassed. It's always going to be strong, but we leave him out. I think the strongest fighter is Goku Black. I say he used Goku's followers and base to follow his own in a unique way. So does that mean that Merch obviously is unbeatable? Even my standards from Dragon Ball World, I think it's something to call. I think it's printing to call Zamasu a cheat character. <laughs> yeah, he has, to, he has to unravel how to beat down his enemy and empower him with him. With no fights, all attacks. Another highlight is all the different techniques. Kind of eat. Look, dude, I, ne I, I never thought about this. Merch Zamasu should be able to do Kaioken. The, 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 you know, the call him how. Huh? Fucking spirit bomb, those godlike powers that he, that he has in his form, the sword which he uses in the preview. Like he has all these types of abilities. Dude, he's a fucking he is a fucking cheap character. Jesus Christ. I hope that the manga the Rogue Super does use these more in the manga. That would be really interesting for him to you know do since the anime didn't do it. But he does have a weakness. I suppose it might be a fact that he was really one person in order to beat Mortal Jones who took the who the body of the Mortal Son Goku. This might be a contradiction action of Goku Fatal to to merge up into who Goku Black is a part of. See? They're foreshadowing it. Maybe they remember, uh, remembered the diffusion. In that case, we'll have Goku and company have a shot at victory. Goku Vegeta becomes Jiso. Right, I'm going to see if Trunks will get a chance to sign too. And actually, will be the key to the battle. Keep your eyes peeled. So, we might. So, Trunks might still up Samatsu with the help of Ishido. Not really my theory, but if I'm right, I'm right. But this arc has been really fucking fantastic. One of the best arcs in Dragon Ball Super. One of the best arcs in Dragon Ball Super. By far, like by far, like oh my god, dude! I'm gonna miss Trunks. If he doesn't, you know, achieve Super Saiyan Blue, that's fine by me. He has that fucking Super Trunks mode, which is like OP as fuck. So yeah, this is my this is my prediction thoughts slash interview thing of Dragon Ball Super sixty six and so on. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe, guys, and have a good day. Not gonna you guys live. Let's get all get. Let's all get hyped. The Battle of the Fusions Sunday at eight o'clock. Fuck yeah! And sub at nine. Fuck yeah! I'm doing a live reaction to it. I don't care how long it takes to upload that, that, that fucking reaction. I'm doing it. So yeah. Bye.